I think it would make sense to just kind of start going back to the roots, back to 1984 when uh, you started Dell. Everybody knows that Dell began in your dorm room at the University of Texas, um, but I wonder if you can shed a little light on the unique opportunity you saw then, and, and I think that might shed a little light on the conversation as we get deeper into it. I was uh, always interested in math and science, and, and uh, when the microprocessor showed up, um, I was, um, you know, like uh, 10, 12 years old, and I was sort of digging into all this stuff. And um, 1981, IBM introduced the, the, the IBM PC. And I started taking them apart and, you know, figuring out what was inside and learning about all the, the uh, hardware and the software, electronics. Uh, and the thing that I observed was that the, uh, the, the, the parts inside the computer None of them were made by IBM. And uh, I calculated it was about $500 worth of cost. And they, and, and they were selling the computer for about $3,000. And that seemed, uh, you know, Goodness. kind of, well, it, it seemed actually at first unfair. You know, it's, it's like, like, how come they're charging so much? And then, uh, you know, they had these computer dealers that were selling the computers and they were, uh, you know, people that, that the week before had been selling car stereos or shoes, and they really didn't know anything about the computers. And, so, and that, that seemed like another problem, okay? And so, uh, you know, as I was, I was, as I was sort of go, going along, it kind of occurred to me, hey, you know, we could sell the computers directly to the customer, and... Uh, it was another problem. It actually took IBM a really long time to get the latest technology into the computer. So you could read about or learn about new technology, but it took like forever, you know, to get it. You know, certainly if you're 16 years old, you know, forever isn't very long. But but uh, you get the idea. So. Um, uh, yeah, I kind of saw this this opportunity, and um, you know, business business took off. Um, so you know that story. You were what, what was your age at that point? I uh, incorporated Dell um, when I was 19. 19. It was it was the end of my freshman year. It was one week before my final exams. Maybe not the best time to you know <laughs> incorporate a company, but that's what I did. So. Yeah.